Welcome back to the Goat Channel. We are going to do a three hole challenge again. This one's going to be a little bit different though. We're going to have to use one certain club at least once each hole. And that's going to be this wood. It is a Patty Berg Wilson Professional. Patty Berg Wilson Professional. Uh, Wilson, there you go. It's actual wood. Um, it's a seven. So we got to use it once a hole. I don't really know what the distance of it's going to be. Uh, so I don't know whether to use it off the drive or use it off the next shot. Um, so I am going to use do one warm-up shot with it just to see how it feels because I've never swung it before. And then go from there. So based on that, we're going to hit driver off the tee and use it for the second shot. Pretty good shot it's a little in the goalie over there but uh not bad at all the worst part is going to be the next shot all right so the first one or the one with the driver didn't go quite as far as i thought uh, but it's going to be kind of a who knows what's going to happen here if we seen the wood swing before this is not going to be pretty. Well, it didn't matter if it was embedded in the ground or not. This is just not my club. Um, let's try again. Well. This is my third shot. It was not pretty looking um, with the wood. I tried it a bunch more times. I could not hit that thing, but we're still gonna use it one time per hole. So, that one. Went a little right, but I think it's gonna get a good kick down the hill. Mm. Future reference, don't swing a wood club. Okay, this is gonna be for our... Um, I think four. With all the drops and... Triple on 14, first hole of the challenge. Didn't go well. All right, we're on a par five, already at plus three. The wooden club did not treat as well. I don't know. We got to use it once per hole though. This is all 15, par five, plus three. I'd like to get out of this with plus one.
played that how I want it to. I opened up just a little bit. Um, it stayed a little flatter than I wanted, but the concept was there. Get a little slice on it, a little fade on it. Uh, and it did, it did what I want it to. So we should be in a pretty good position to hit our next shot, middle of the fairway. It didn't fade as, quite as much as I would have liked. I would have liked a little bit more on that because um, it would have rolled out of the thing, especially when it's dry, it rolls a little better too. So we're going to go hit the three wood um, and then we'll figure out when we're going to use the wood. Uh, the wood is not fun. I figured that out. Uh, it's pretty hard to hit, but here we go on our second shot, par five. Probably going with the three wood. Uh, we'll have to go find our ball real quick here. Not in a great position. Um, cut it a little too, like I said, if I would have faded just a little bit more. Perfect position. It could have probably went out at two. Uh, maybe a laying up, maybe a three wood. Yeah, we'll see. I think I might try that seven again. The wood to use it on this hole. So I think the uh, it wasn't a bad out. Um, I don't know. I'm pretty sure this is made for golf. Um, look at that. Not good. Uh, good news is though, second shot. We're in a good position to still get a birdie. All right, seven iron in hand. I think we're about 150 out somewhere here and we got a broken broken wood now so that's yeah, all good the wood was just for a challenge anyway so get that challenge out of the way I'm still going to use it on the next hole though so uh, we're on the hill About pin high. It's always the second swing um, that hits better because I decided to hit another one. Crushed it. Um, very good shot, actually. So, I don't know. It's pretty wet out here. So, I've been replacing balls and, you know, lift and replace and all that good stuff. But <sighs> the second one's putting distance for I guess what would be a uh, birdie attempt now we're just trying to get up and down for par we're already plus three on the challenge heck you have days like this my last video I filmed today same day uh, I played pretty well I ended up even I think or no it's plus one uh, but I had a real good shot to be even so um every other hole but i also hit that wood and that was a mess so here we go so i've been pitching with my uh, pitching wedge or chipping with my pitching wedge seems like it works better for me at least right now until i start getting it under control and getting better but um i just want to show you all the second golfer is always better if you can see i'm on the green Pretty good distance away in a putt, but I would have been on some greenery. Would have been putting for a birdie. Now we are pitching for hopefully up and down par. Not a bad putt, plus one. So plus four, seeing that we got a plus three on our first hole of the challenge. Plus four on this par five, 15. Going to 16, we're working with a little bit. It's getting dark, um, so not too much daylight left. But check out that view, can't beat it. 
this is why you come play golf or relax and play like crap uh -oh. and take pictures of nice scenery that's why i play 100 over some days 100 over golf yeah it'd be all right so we're on to 16. it's a dog leg lift um hit a good drive you could be about 40 in uh i'll tell you this is when we get up there it says it's 378 but it's downhill i'm pretty sure it plays shorter than that uh, so we'll be taking driver try to go to the right try and get it high enough here trying to go towards the left i mean so we still have to use the wood at some point All right, I got a six in, probably. Um, it was kind of a line drive. Then since this is the last drive of the hole, I hit a button. Pretty difficult lie, but from where we were at, uh, we'll take it. All right, pretty tough spot here. Or kind of honestly, I don't know what we're gonna do. Hit that tree in front of us, knock yourself out, probably. Uh, but we're gonna take a 60 degree at it. I don't know where the try to go through this gap or that gap. I think we're going to have to punch it, so we're going to go with the pitching wedge. This is our third shot. If we can punch it onto the green and have a putt would be nice. I'm going to try to punch it around this way. Maybe close my hands a little bit on the way through. Try that. So we're up on the hill. Now we can use our 60. We got snagged by a root, opened our club face up, barely made contact. Well, considering that was for our par, we're going to make bogey, but at least we only have to put a little bit with this club right here. Right, as you've seen, we're going to put with this right here. That's probably one of my best recovery shots I've ever had. Um, this is for par. This thing don't have a center to it, though. So... We could get bogey on it. I'm gonna choke down. Try to hit it similar to a normal putt. Ah. Well, ended up bogeying anyway, but that was one of the best recovery shots I've ever hit. Uh, honestly, I'm impressed by it. The first recovery shot was not good. Um, no, I think we, we doubled. Yeah. So we double bogeyed actually. So we got like plus six on this challenge, but we started out with a full club, ended up with a broke club. Uh, but it was a fun little challenge. I enjoyed it. I know one thing that I cannot hit the old wood clubs. Uh, definitely not one of my strong suits. Uh, again, we got an Aussie putter giveaway at a thousand subscribers some golf balls uh some pro v ones are in there a number of different things uh kevin durant rookie card for the trading card people 
because that's kind of basically my channel at this point trading cards and golf two favorite things uh i'm just trying to make it uh something popular i mean something i i enjoy doing give the fans some stuff you know give people out there you know idea what you can do on a golf course even if you suck basically uh, i am working hard to get better have i got better yes am i completely there obviously not uh but i i do enjoy it a lot and you know you know get your mind off thing golf golf get your minds off you know a bunch of things and if you haven't listened to my podcast i've got it on anchor and spotify and all the you know major platforms and you know i talk about my anxiety and stuff like that uh golf is excellent for that sometimes it's hard to film um but trust me i mix in filming with coming out here and just playing a nice little round uh by myself and you can't beat it uh, it's one of the most relaxing things so this is the goat channel and we got plus six on the wooden club challenge not a good score but hey we had fun didn't we uh so subscribe like come back